Welcome to Mashele Money Podcast in partnership with Bifim Unit Trust. Remember, we are giving you this educational series every other Thursday from 7 p.m. Today, Ernale Me Mongkwakile Pile, who is the Unit Trust Specialist here at Bifim Unit Trust, who will be taking us through long-term investing and creating wealth. Mongkwakile. Welcome to Michelle Money Podcast. Thank you for having me, Seth. Yes. Um, so in the in the past week, we had a very interesting discussion around investing and saving for for a better tomorrow. And we spoke about you know different investing platforms and solutions that Bifim has to to offer. Mm-hmm. Um, so today I want us to talk about investing and the wealth creation. You know, um, often at times there's this um, perception that for you to become wealthy, um, it has to be a lengthy process um, of investing. And there are different types of um, views um, in the market around, um, you know, day traders who can actually make money today, become rich today. And those who really believe that um, wealth creation is a is a long term thing. So I, I want us to um, you know to 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 to, to discuss this and, and and clear the air. What is the center? What is it that people need to understand? The truth is, everybody in life wants to get rich quickly and live mm. life as grand as they can, yeah. king size. Eh? Yeah. But at the end of the day, everything that is worthwhile will take time. Mm. Wealth is no different. Wealth needs discipline and it also needs um, perseverance. Mm. But at the heart of it, investing will need you to make good investment decisions to get mm. to wealth. Yes. Wealth it's in itself means something different for you and mm. for me. I may want to retire early and travel the world, but you may just want to have that big purchase and settle down. Yeah. At the nitty gritties of it, no matter what we are trying to get to, ultimately we want to live one, a comfortable life, two, maybe be debt free if mm. that's what yeah. your investment goals look at, yeah. and also just also be prepared for the eventualities that life may bring mm. day to day. Yeah. You know, I, I, I like how you put it, Tore, um, you know, wealth looks differently um, to different people. Mm. Um, but then the question would be, um, na so how, 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 how do we go about it, um, mm. you know, um, getting to attain wealth? You know, Sad, when you look at wealth, you might think, a grand concept of um, yachts and huge mm, assets. Mm. In itself, it's just an accumulation of assets, yeah. no matter how big or small of, uh, they are. Mm. Yes, the yacht is a, a huge asset that may be wa- wealth to one person, but my small livestock at the Moraga as well may be wealth. Yeah. So wealth in its definition, you shouldn't look at it in terms of the scale, but it's individualistic plans and goals that you have. Mm. Mm. Now, in investing, you want to make decisions that will guide you to your wealth and that will guide you to wealth creation in itself. So, a Bethlehem Pathfinder is, can be a good resource in that wealth creation according to your goals. Yeah. We at Bifim can give you all the information that um, through our offering can help you propel and get ready to, for you to be at a state where According to your financial goals, you mm. are wealthy. Yes. Umoka wotsa hore, how re investing wisely? Sinta sinta ora mungo. Well, investing wisely involves a few steps, Tata. Mm. But in investment, we must always remember that um, there is a certain level of risk that you might ex- um, need to accept yes. when you want to grow the mm. money that you have or the mm. capital that you have. Yes. So investment in itself needs to start with three essential steps. Mm -hmm. You need to have a plan. If you don't have a plan, start with one. Mm. Because if you don't plan, you are planning to fail. Mm, Absolutely. And that's the way it is with investment. Once you have your goals in mind, you can then move on because you always need to remember your why. Yes. Second of all, you need to start early. 
Now early I'm not saying time don't think that your time yeah. has passed yeah. start <laughs> as soon as you can yeah. look at your journey where you need to be where you want to be and start because if you put money into the market which is what in essentially investing will do yeah. you need to expose your money or your investment to the market for as long a time as possible yeah. so that it recuperates and recovers from the ups and downs in the market yeah. that is when you will get the return that you you're looking for in mm. investment. Yes. And the last step would be to have that long-term mindset. It's not a quick game. Mm. Um you are in it for the long run. Have that perspective in your investment journey. Remember you had a plan. Re- reference that plan. Stick to your goals and at all times be in line with that goal. So once you have these three things in check, your plan you've started as soon as possible as soon mm. as you could and also you are in it for the long run mm. you are then able to um get as much value or a yield um from your investment as you possibly can investing is a long term game and the perception should be of discipline and should be of trying to grow the capital over the long run yes Wow, um that was quite lengthy and very very informative. You know, I Karatila Tata Haore, um you know, we, one needs to also assess their risk appetite. Mm. Um because I think um you know, generally in in our market, um a lot of people want to make a lot of money. Mm. Um but nobody wants to lose money. Mm. Um so then when you ask someone, um how much are you willing to lose? I'm not willing to lose anything. <laughs> um but then I want to make as much money as possible. Mm. And then what I want the risk appetite is not aligned. Yes. Um it needs to be aligned. Um go mo go rang gore go tabele gore mo leng gore thalo sa di step e tsone se no bua ka tsone gore um once we tsu gore plan ya gago ke what is it that you want to achieve when do you want to achieve it then it becomes um easy for you to invest well um mo khori um any 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 last advice that you want to give i think um let's look at it like that just as we've explained mm. let's look at it with a mindset of long term growth yeah. let's look at investments with a mindset of a risk appetite uh, i'm willing to put in money into investments but i also want to get a return so therefore the return has to come over a period of time mm. and that's the best way to approach investments be patient and be disciplined according to your goals mm. um, at wow. befim unit trust we're able to solution um um the investment decisions for you and look at um based on our offering how best can we um you we give you information that will slot in with your goals wonderful Hey, Monkhoki, um I, I, I just wanted to know gore wena hela um in your own experience um do it's it's investing long term short term I do it's long gore go dilele gore wa di ruta go ngoko gae kana ke do it's long gore di rutile go skolong kana o di thalogantse ntso le motona ya nobereka I think it's a combination of both hey sa tla um ba tsa di ba rona ba go dile bana le meraka and ba simolotse hela moraka ga go go sa bola we khomo go te a itsela gore ta bola after a while i think that's the concept you know you putting in money into a certain investment or a certain asset we it's gore after a while it will bear fruit in my individual capacity i didn't have any um investments set up yeah. um when i started working mm. or even two years into my working mm. life up until very recently um during covid that's when i had a true emergency fund that could cover two or three months past um in case of a, a terrible situation yeah yeah so it is a combination mm. i've known from an early age that you need to save and reap the rewards in the future yeah. but in my um career i only had to have a wake up call mm. during that covid pandemic to yeah. kind of sit down and say but where are my investments yeah. where is my um financial health mm. yeah mm. wow i i like how you drove it home go ka maraka because ba tsona ba le bantsi ba ba rata ko maraka eng gape most of them they've either grown up in a setup ya maraka or ha ba go la ba ba tlo itirela maraka um and 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 they understand the principle ha ba le ko maraka you know of investing or no gona ana le ha o botsa motho ta ba go bolela gore nya ka la go mpio no um ke santse ke ke go risa di khomo ke tata ke ke rekisa ko morago you know but um it's funny how with financial services 
um, you know, it's it's always different. They yeah. they, they, they think about it different. Mm. and then how how we tell But Yes. In that same way, yes. your investments, give them time to grow. Yes. Give them time to bear more fruit yes. in that same way. That wow. is wealth. Wow. That is wealth creation. Wow. Um, so, thank you for having me, Sakhi. Yes. Mm. Um, so, long-term investing is the way to go. Um, you need to be patient with the process and follow the steps. Um, so how about you can always um, get a hold of them? Um, go Bifim um, Smart Invest um, at www.bifim.co.bw. How about you can get a hold of them? Um, go Bifim um, Smart Invest at www.bifim.co.bw. Or WhatsApp them at seven six two two seven zero one seven.